Hello, this is Leo, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Tally H500, the carbon edition, which is the US edition, but it's the same for regardless whether it's white or carbon. Um, this video is uh, a boring video for those who wanted it. So, uh, as you can see, I'm just pointing out all the screws, lots of screws, and there's a total of 30 screws to open up. And just a quick view of the Tally H500. A little preview of the ESCs uh, looks really neatly put together. And it's the flight controller, as you could see how it's been connected, uh, external compass and GPS, very very similar to the X350 Pro and another look at the ESCs and the motor a little bit about the design of the compass the compass has been routed out to the GPS on the top there and that's to reduce the interference as well as to improve the performance of the compass here I'm showing you the gimbal port uh, I was inspecting the gimbal port, so it's two screws that attaches it, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like underneath. And it's similar to the USB port. Uh, I did point out in a prototype that uh, the USB cable, which connects to the uh, mission planner, it's uh, inside. So. The ports are now routed out to the frame. Let us preview of the uh, ESCs. And that's the receiver, it's a 705. Akira RX 705. That's the battery bay which holds the 6S 54 milliampere per hour battery the FCS H500 flight controller it's very similar to the Devo M which uses a data bus to reduce the number of wires required for all those channels that's all folks hope this helps have a good day Hi there, this is Liu from the DIY Drone Channel. Today we have for you a interesting little package from FanUTAC. It's a flight controller for fixed wings. Let's take a look what's inside. 